I could not distinguish red or green until basically 200 yards. Joe Modafferi knew he needed his eyes tested. Okay, so keep looking at the green line for me. When his ophthalmologist found out he had diabetes, a red flag went up. It was not just that dropped me the side, but the, my eyes were deteriorating. So much so, Modafferi was at the point where he might no longer be able to drive. He had diabetic macular edema, which affects up to 10% of those with diabetes. Small blood vessels in the back of the eye leak fluid and cause swelling in the back of the eye. And when it gets swollen, your vision goes down. Lasers are often used to help with the condition, but when the leak or swelling is in the center of vision, treatment options are limited. Now Health Canada has approved a drug called Lucentis to help regain vision. These agents are anti-vascular endothelial growth factor agents. They reduce the swelling, they reduce the amount of leakage. The only way to get the medication into the back of the eye is through an injection. This may smart a little bit. Often they will say within a week or two, depending on the level of vision, that they noticed an improvement or a change. Dr. Peter Curtis was involved in the studies reviewed by Health Canada to approve Lucentis. The patients using Lucentis gained more vision than the patients using laser therapies. Currently, Lucentis is not covered by OHIP. Patients often need multiple injections at a cost of $1,700 each. Most patients, on, or on average, uh, they were able to gain uh, almost two whole lines of vision. The Lucentis injections have meant Motiferi can stay on the road. Uh, I see a lot, of, a lot of improvements. Lights does not bother me as much at night with the glare. Beatrice Politi, Global News.